And we're here today to do some PvP, but before we do that, we are getting our first guaranteed. Uh, I'm not sure who I want to pick. Actually, I kind of do know who I want to pick, so let's go ahead and do it. So there's reasoning behind every decision that I make, usually when it comes to Kachi games, especially when it comes to counts. Ooh, he looks like we're going to ask- Ooh! Uh, the only thing I really would like here is another Elizabeth dupe. A green Liz dupe. Uh, nothing else in the banner is really like, Oh my god, what happened? I had it so good. No, the banner kind of sucks. But green Liz dupes? more welcome because those help with the bird raid but there is a strategy that i want to go through or go for in this uh picking for ooh, look at that uh for the actual selector now uh, most of you guys should go for dairy and you should because that's smart but for me hi there that was the fastest ssr uh what is that probably just a coin yeah is that all we got yeah, <laughs> green escort. What's up, brother? I think that's his first dupe. Maybe. Oh, I actually don't know. Alright, so we'll go to Selector. So, you should either go for Dare Airy or Grand uh, Master Zarathos, right? They're both good. Uh, Grand, Master, uh, Grand Master is good for the Bellmoth raid, and then Dare Airy is good for, you know, the uh, the Bunny Ear Demon raid, right? Good for PvE. I'm going for her because I still need dupes for her, and she's the one I really want to select so uh check reward i want dupes of my og team because eventually i'm gonna have a full roster of ogs anyway so i might as well pick what i want so that's why i'm picking these guys if you guys are new to the channel make sure you hit the like button subscribe if you are new and uh let me know in the comments below which three characters are you going for oh it's gonna just break, take us to rank huh uh that's cool but i think for my daily where it at we gotta do Four v fours. So, champions three. I don't know if I have any more. Now we're out of those. So what we'll eat for is crit chance food, and we'll go in and get slapped real fast. Uh, now that I'm at champions three, I mainly just grit. Like, ah uh, man, it's 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 just whale galore after a certain point, and it's not really fun either. I feel like they need to rebalance the the system instead of basing it off who goes first off a of CC. Maybe make it a rock paper scissors. Uh thing instead because like at least then the non-whales have a chance to go first you know i know i feel like a lot of people would just quit because like quit the uh, match if they didn't have to go first which i mean it's more wins for us right oh my god sweat oh my god sweat but i don't know man there's not a good way to balance this pvp because they're keep releasing broken characters like for example margaret is broken Armail is pretty good. I would call him broken. Uh, but yeah, Margaret's broken. Goddess Liz is broken. You have the one who's broken. Bond is broken. Like, there's so many broken characters. So it's like, it's hard to play. Ooh, yeah, do that again to me. Oh, okay. Well, that's four stacks on Mona. I need a couple more. But, uh, yeah, I'm gonna rocket punch to Margaret. Check my stack. This should be four. Five. Nice. Well picked. So we have our good old smacker tapper. And then we'll shin do his thing. But yeah, I feel like there's just too much unbalance. Oh wow, they have invasion food. I respect it. Well, I couldn't disable her with a rocket punch, so that's awkward. We know it's a person too, since invasion food was activated. Very interesting. We'll get to rank up our uh hand next turn. I don't want to go with level three oxidize. Okay. I mean, that's your choice, man. Uh, we'll do this. If they want to cleanse it, they can cleanse it. Get that rank up. I like Shin's balance birds in a rank up. I just wish it was two attacks instead of three attacks, because if it was two attacks, at least you could get it turn one, then, or more so than having to rely on RNG to draw his card, right? I think Shin's got a good balance version in a rank up. And I just want them to buff it slightly where it's, you just use two cards and you rank up. Because then it's more manageable and you have to make the choice if you want to rank up or lose the damage. He really does not like my Shin. Who's he ranking up here? Oh, he's rushing Tarmi a lot. Okay. Oh, they took Oxidize. Look how much damage they took from Oxidize. Uh, yeah, that's how good Oxidize is, by the way, if you didn't know. Oxidize is insane. They didn't cleanse it, so all that damage was just from Oxidize alone. Margaret's definitely dead. Darmiel? I don't know. Darmiel might... No, Darmiel's just like... But yeah, 
So anyone that was wondering what Oxidize actually did, look at their HP. They didn't cleanse their hand, I deranked a bunch of their cards, and they didn't use those cards that were deranked, so they just got Oxidized, and uh, they took a lot of damage, right? Ooh, we have an alt here, but he's gonna probably take it down, which is unfortunate. Who's he ranking up? Yeah, Tarmiel. Super Shield, he's gonna, not gonna de rank he is. And I don't really need to use her card to win at this point, that's fine. Uh, we gotta take both those down, so... One... The two... And what we'll do is we'll just start... To, we'll just start focusing Garmiel out of here. We can use Oxidize next turn. They have no way to cleanse it now, so it's whatever. Take that. Let me just take all y'all goodies. All those good goods. Yes. And then we go in. You should take more damage because he's blocking, right? Boom. He's almost dead. An Oxidize will kill him. Though he gets a little bit of healing this turn. I know it will kill him. A knife to the uh, a knife to the head will kill him, I'm sure. I like how my team is just like 3-3 three, three and ultimates across the board, except uh, Shin. He's like 6-6. Six, six. He's just like, yeah, bro. I, I, I've been here a while. <laughs> Doesn't hurt as much. He forfeited. <laughs> Well, you have to see Oxidize and it's like fullest like potential. You saw the damage it can really do. It's it's really sick. It is really sick. Alright, we're gonna get another go through team with Shen. That'll be interesting. Um I don't know what that middle guy does. So my main concern is just making sure that he gets sealed. And then I guess we just try to do this. Next turn. We're not gonna use it now. Let them build up cards first and then we'll use it. Cause it's all about me ranking cards. So let them let them get some cards for them together. I'm not sure if killing the guy in the center is to play, because I have no idea what he does to be honest. Hmm. Let's save the Russian channel. Which I can I can I can manage it all. Ooh, they are going for ranking up. That, that's cool. Okay. So what we'll do is... Oh, he merged, so we'll do this. Uh, we'll disable Gother again. Because he's going to rank up no matter what we do, right? And then... Oh. What if we just go for an AoE single target? Or AoE. Um, level 1, I meant. All its cards will get de ranked at the end of, or whatever, and uh, this will take some damage. Ooh, we kill one here. Boom. Who's your backliner? Let me see your backliner. Death Pierce? I'm not sure. Who do you run in the backline there? Wait. It's. Oh, why is he there? That's a weird team. They are Shin ult. They are trying to ult rush or rush with Shin. It's fine. We can just. We could take his ult gauge away. They have no taunt, so it's free takeaway. We'll just have to do that this turn. That's fine. Who cares? Pretty sure we disabled him, so... Oh, Oxidize ticked on him. Yeah, we're not letting you do that, buddy. And then what we'll do is... We'll target and try to kill him. Get the out of here. Like, at this point, go there can't carry the team. Shin does, they lose. Well, they lost anyway. Should have probably just singled him first, see if I could kill him, and then disable or took away Gother all. But if his if Gother's all one six, I don't care about it. Like he can all all day, he won't do anything to me. Like it's a waste of a, it's just a waste of a card at that point. So I'll let him get his ult. That's a waste of a card. His ult does no damage at one six. It does no damage at two or three six. It don't do anything until six six. That's how like that's how bad Gother's ult is. So if you guys pull Gother, and you have his ultimate, don't even use it. It's trash. It does 8% of my health. Congrats. His his other cards will do more than that. Let's check him out. Like, I'll, I'll prove it to you. What's your all that, buddy? 1-6. 8% damage. Deletes 2 uh, skills. Congrats, buddy. Congrats. You, you are just a joke. We'll do this. And then... Well, I don't even want to kill him. I want him to do it, so... Alt me. I actually don't care. Alt me. You could have some oxidized though for uh for the meme. This will do no damage to me. 
It's going to be hilarious. Look at my HP bars. They're not gonna budge. <laughs> not by adult anyway. Okay, I don't think he can kill Easton. Oh, he's not ulting? He didn't ult. Okay. Cute. So what we'll do is... I gave you a chance to ult. I still want him to ult. So we'll give him a chance to ult. We'll flood him. And then... I want him to ult, but he's not going to. Do it. We'll do that. I'll just kill Zeldris, so he has to ult. This will also heal up uh, Easton. I hope it doesn't kill him. Oh, okay. I was hoping he wouldn't kill. Good. I just want to make sure that he's off the field so he's forced into a situation where he has to ult. Because Easton, like, if he ults, Easton doesn't die. Even at that low HP, Easton won't die. He won't ult because he knows it's trash. That's pretty bad when you know you're ult trash. Bro, please ult. Please. I'm begging. I'm giving you the chance to ult. Just, just ult. Like... I don't know, I don't know how to delay any longer. I don't. <laughs> I've tried to delay so you can see how bad his ult is. Maybe now that I block his skill effect, he'll ult. Ult me. Please be intelligent enough to ult me. Insert a fake PNG of me down here, just in shame because this guy went off. Ugh. Boring, man. He, he knows his ult's trash. That's why he didn't ult. <laughs> yeah, they're so bad. Oh, Gother is so bad, boys. I don't know what to tell you. Like, if you suffer for 1 6 Gother, I am sorry you got a bad character. You literally just got the worst character in the game. Uh, well, he's not the worst character in the game, but he's arguably one of the worst. But, uh, when it comes to his ult, at least. That's it for this video, guys. I can't really go around trolling more Gothers. I feel bad. So, uh, make sure you guys are hitting that subscribe button. You're hitting the like button. You let me know. Did you guys summon for Gother? If you did, did you regret it? Or do you have a way to use him without his ultimate? Because it's pretty much what it's going to be, right? Thanks, Barry. Got here. But, uh, yeah. Let me know, guys. Did you summon or did you skip Gother? Peace, guys.